Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting reading to episode 11 of season 3 of Yuki Yuna is a Hero. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Well, and yes, unless Yuna does something, but who knows what the heck is going to happen? I mean, because, woo! Come here, baby. The fact that we are just continuing right where we left off, but still at the same time, like, Togo, going after Yuna, we need to see that one more time. Not even that worked. Exactly. If we go, we go together. Oh, they're going to make me tear up. Jesus, I'm not ready for this. It's not even the last episode. But see, at the same time, it makes me wonder, why didn't Fu go with her? I mean, did she, because, like, okay, everybody knows Togo is the only one who can reach Yuna the most and make Yuna stop. So I get it. Fu wants to stay back and do her shit and let Togo go. But still, she could have done something else. Like, as much as I love her doing this badass scene again, 
And we're seeing Togo just going off on her own to go get Yuna. Still, everybody should be able to come. Please let her survive. I don't want anyone else in this group dying. Okay, where's you now? Okay, well, that's darkness. Oh, okay, never mind. Yuna? There's always another way.
Oh god, hurry, because she's getting closer to death. To be right there. Right there. <sighs> My heart, I can't. We already lost Jin. And that still fucking hurts. Plus, you know, walk of us group in that situation. I don't want to lose anybody else. Jin? This hurts. It's everybody. At least you'll be together.
If this don't end it, I don't know what fucking will. Now let's say because of this, what if everyone once again is fucking reborn? Remember when it was died previously? This shit. Oh, gun. Oh, gun. Aw, oh, damn it. If only they could all see this now. I mean, but they were there though, as spirits. But still, if they could have a second chance at life. And to see this in the series finale for this next episode next week, oh, I would love that. And that is the second time, second freaking time, that that thing has done that. So, okay, hold on. Let me go ahead and ask this. Is Gookie supposed to be the Yuna, that other Yuna, like the spirit form or something? Because there's still a whole bunch of unanswered questions with Gookie and the rest of them things. Now I wonder that bridge that you know got effed up during like chapter Washi. Like, is that bridge now to normal in it? Is it back together? Oh, yeah, it's gone. Oh, Yuna. How about a freaking hug and go out to karaoke in it? God, this felt like the last episode. Oh, why would you share with that? Stop it! Oh, my heart. <laughs> so possibly in a way, Wakaba had to die beforehand. Because even Wakaba's spirit um, made an appearance as well. Like, ever, it seemed like everybody all fought, uh, heroes who either survived and then eventually died maybe because of old age or something everyone made an appearance and oh god that was beautiful this was even though this ain't the finale episode this was a beautiful episode very artistic very good on the cinematography everything else the the Seiyus, especially Togo Seiyu, like, uh, Togo and Yunus both did that. I mean, of course with Sonochi's, like, of course, because we all know who that is, but, I mean, everybody in this cast, our, our lovely group of girls, every Seiyu did a damn good job in the little bit of time that they had for this episode, I think now... This is probably the best episode of season three after all the depression that we had leading up to this. Like, oh, 
it's finally over and these girls can just be regular girls again and not have to worry about being stressed and everything. I mean, oh, I'm happy for them. I am sad that, you know, it's not going to be the same after this, but they get to start anew, they get to hang out more, and they don't have to worry about life or death situations. It makes you wonder um, what specifically how this is going to end next week. Um, possibly, if maybe so. I still would like to see, you know, because it, even though I have not played the game for this series um, and seeing, uh, even though, like, it, it is still five Yunas, I'm so, how in the world is it five freaking Yunas? Like, I don't know. Um, I still want to see. Fallen heroes who have died in this series all come back to life. But really, it's more essentially canon to the mobile game in that, where everyone is all still alive, da-da-da, this is that and the third, and they're okay. Very similar to the um, Magical Recording game and such, because there's so many characters who have died in Madoka Magica, Magical Recording, and then in the Magical Recording series, they're alive. And it's like, okay! Are we in a different timeline and such? Which, even even though I know so much about that series, I will still get confused, even as of today. Um, but seriously, that's what I want to see. If we do get to see a different Yuna, maybe Yuna 3, Yuna 4, Yuna 5, um, interacting with our Yuki Yuna and the previous Yuna would be nice. Like, I mean, we got to see her at the end of this episode, which is sweet. But I want to see all these girls slowly but surely interacting. Do I think we should need a season four with this? Honestly, even though we're not done with this yet, it's a, I'll, I'll say it's a maybe. That's what I'll say. If there's more to the story for Yuki Yuna and her group, then yes. If there really is nothing else after this girl, these group of girls, no. But if there is something else beyond these girls where it's another group of heroes, then yes, I get that. Um... It wouldn't be, it, it wouldn't surprise me if by like sometime next week or probably during the Christmas break, we do find out um, essentially that something is confirmed. So probably by like next Friday, we'll probably maybe find out something. I'm not really 100% sure. But I'm just happy that that mark is finally gone. Like, oh, you, you don't even know because when that mark was there in Chapter Hero and I was like, we really going to end the show like this? And, you know, at that time, we didn't know if it was going to get a third season, but I was like, we're really ending the show like this? <laughs> and, and everything that happened, you know, her going to go save Togo and then, you know, this is that and the third and everything that happened in that chapter. But like, oh my God, just, oh, but my heart. My heart, I'm just, I want to, I want to keep crying right now. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction to be towards episode 11 of season three of Yuki Yuna is a Hero. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like, it really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Matchless Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially all either possibly next Friday due to the fact is that I will be starting to work on Monday. And I don't know if I will be back by the time this comes out or sometime after. If I don't get this out um, on Friday, I will get it out for you Saturday morning so that you guys can have it. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye.